Today we're driving our latest build off the line, which is a uh, LS3 powered D90. We're gonna take it around for a little bit of a cruise, just listen to it. It is a convertible, so it's gonna have outside noise, but it gives us a good opportunity to figure out if there's anything we need to look at in particular and uh, what we need to fix or adjust to make this a proper ECD build. Uh, this customer opted for a, uh, a nice seating selection. He did rear benches, he did Corbo front seats, also with our ECD custom console. He also did it with rear cup holders and a mid-row AC system in it, so it's gonna be good for your passengers as well. They picked out a very nice uh, matched wood grain for our doubled in unit and our switch panels. We matched it to the steering wheel and also did a custom wood floor in the back to go along with the beach look of this vehicle. We paired it up with a really nice blue on the outside. The color combination matched really well. Uh, it's a very comfortable vehicle. So far it's riding on standard Land Rover Springs uh, with upgraded shock absorbers. So it's gonna have a little bit stiffer of a ride than our air suspension, but so far just on the little bit of driving we're doing, it actually feels really comfortable. Paired it with a 16 inch steel wheels. So it gives it more of a classic look. And that's I believe why he went with the seating configuration that he did. We also did the Puma dash for it, uh, which gives it the better infotainment system, better air conditioning, better gauge selection. Also, just off of that little bit of braking, I'm hearing just a little bit of scrub from the brake pads. But these, these brakes are brand new. They haven't been broken in yet. So once we get everything uh, broken in and done our test miles on it, all that all that noise should be gone pretty, uh, pretty good. And it'll be like normal braking. This one's paired with an LS3 with its six-speed automatic transmission. And the customer opted for a very quiet exhaust. It's a, didn't, sometimes you don't even realize it's running until you can feel just the slight vibration from the engine. Um, it sounds very much like a, a stock 6.2 liter with a, a very quiet exhaust. And I guess they, they like that more than some of our louder options. But this one's, it's got a nice little rumble to it. So you can, you can hear it when you get on it. And when you're not, you're just cruising, it's nice and quiet. So it's not droney or bad on the highway. All right, guys, so I'm going to go out and I'm going to drive this thing a little bit harder. I'm going to try to bed in the brakes a little bit and really root out everything that I can and, f and find on it. And I'll see you guys around. <laughs> 